been watching my health a lot better lately. I'm finally remembering to take my vitamin D now that I keep it next to my crack pipe. <laughs> oh, come on, man. You should know better. Do I look like the kind of guy that takes vitamin D? Come on. I've been told I look like the kind of guy that has a manifesto. A lot of you agree. Looks can be deceiving. I don't have a manifesto. In a, in a related story, I also am not a conspiracy theorist. And uh, I don't believe in the Illuminati. Those of you who do, I just really don't get it. I mean, I, I understand, I get it. I get what the Illuminati is. It's supposed to be the, the shadow government that's controlling everything, right? But what I don't get about that is you, you know, okay, I'm about, to, I'm about to say something that's very sexist and racist. Now, you've been here for a while, right? Normally you don't get a warning. I'm giving you a warning. I think all of our problems are being caused by a handful of white guys. Truth! I'm sorry, hashtag truth! Hashtag, saying hashtags out loud. Okay, so... No, but it's fucking true. See, this is why I don't believe in the Illuminati, because every day you watch the news, you go on the internet, you go on Twitter, there's a bunch of rich, there's politicians and billionaires, sometimes both, saying, hi, I'm fucking up the world, hi, it's me, I'm fucking up the world, hi, nice to meet you, I'm fucking up the world, right? They're, they're not hiding. So if you believe in the Illuminati, that would be like if you left the club tonight, right, you go out on the street, some guy punches you in the face, and you go, oh, dude, who's behind this? <laughs> Are you being controlled by a shadow boxer? No, that's pretty bad. That shadow boxer part I could probably toss out, but thanks for going with me on that. I think it's true. You know, people say these are strange times we're living in. When have times not been strange? That's, do you guys watch the History Channel? Do you crack a book? Times have always been strange. Oddly enough, though, I still have hope. I do. I have hope. I have kids. My kids are cool. I have hope for the next generation. My kids are really cool. My kids and I are best friends. And I've read, I've, some people say that's pathetic. I've read some articles that say you're not supposed to be friends with your kids. I think that's bullshit. I think that's bullshit. I think therapists came up with that. Because, you know, if we got along with our kids and our parents, who'd need therapy? <laughs> oh, shit. Turns out I am a conspiracy theorist. <laughs> I used to have dreams, folks. This used to be a dream. This used to be a gym. Now this is just something to do while I'm waiting to die. That's my TED Talk. Thank you. Bye. Give it up for Joe Kalen, a.k.a. Doc Brown from Back to the Future.